Thank you for being a friend Travel down the road and back again Your heart is true You're a pal and a confidant And if you threw a party Invited everyone you knew You would see the biggest gift would be for me And the car attached would say Thank you for being a friend All right, guys, welcome back. It is Saturday, February 12th. We got a lot of basketball today. We got some hockey today. It is the last day before the Super Bowl. One last shot to build these stacks so that we can just make a million bets on the Super Bowl tomorrow. Very, very excited. Um, we'll, we'll, we'll talk about it all later. Um, like I said, I will have the video out probably first thing tomorrow morning. I might do it, I might get it up late tonight, but it'll be there in the morning. Um, just because it's gonna be a little bit longer, it's gonna take a little bit longer to get completed and to get posted, but it's coming. I'm pumped, I am very pumped. But first we gotta recap Friday. <laughs> Spencer, tough day for, for the defending champion. 0-3 last night, 7-11 on the month, down 4.7 units. Vinny was 1-2, he's 6-12 on the month, down 7.87 units. Steve was 1-2, he's 13-5 on the month, up 8.22 units. Shawnee says 2-1 from Aruba, 10-8 on the month, up 1.06 units. I was one and two yesterday. I man, I thought I was going three and now I really did. Maxi couldn't get the assists. And while the Oilers did actually win a game, which was nice, could not get that over. One and two, nine and nine on the month, up 4.65 units. Huge day for Chris. Three and oh yesterday, big winner on the day. 10 and eight on the month, up 5.66 units. And Wilkie was two and one. He needed some wins. He had a rough couple of days. Two and one, eight and ten on the month, down 0.33 units. So overall, not too bad. You know, uh, it it's not good enough. It's not good enough. We need a rock solid day today to build those stacks so that we can just go as hard as humanly possible on the Super Bowl. So let's take a look at our locks for tonight. <laughs> Spencer sticking with college basketball. Absolutely love it. He's got Towson minus 10, Buffalo minus 11 and a half, and Ohio minus nine and a half. Vinny, he's got Kings and Knicks money lines, Grizzlies and Sixers money lines, and Adesanyo to win by finish. Almost couldn't get that one out there. Steve, he's got Knicks money line and over 208 and a half, Red Wings money line and over four and a half, and Baylor and Auburn both money line. And he's going two units on all his bets today. I, I love it. Going as hard as possible going into tomorrow. Sean, he's got Sixers money line. He's got Bulls minus 13. And then he has a underdog money line parlay for the NHL. He's got Flyers, Canadians, Blackhawks, all money line. That is a whopper coming in at plus 1,268 odds. I got Grizzlies money line and Ja 25 plus, Steph 25 plus, and Warriors minus seven, and Penn State money line. They are in Minnesota tonight. Chris, so far just one pick from Chris, but he's got Heat money line and Jimmy Butler six plus rebounds. And Wilkie, he's got two leg money line parlays for the NBA across the board here. Knicks and Grizzlies, Warriors and Mavs, and Pelicans and Raptors. First baskets, it's, man, first basket business is tough. It's tough right now. The problem is, if we stop, that's when it comes back to what we know. So we're gonna keep it moving. Yesterday, and this this is the, the frustrating part of the pecs I gave you yesterday. So I'll show, I'll show you the sheet here in a second that I was working off of. So I gave you Joe and Thibault. Joe made the second shot on, Fortunate. Uh, Franz Wagner 
took the first shot, did not hit it. And I gave you D'Angelo Russell, he was just a no. But on my sheet, as you can see, see that bottom one, Wendell Carter, because I was going back and forth, whether to give him or Franz Wagner in the video yesterday. And I gave Franz fucking Wagner, even though he took the first shot, it was a good pick. He just didn't make it. And then Wendell Carter didn't make it. So <sighs> it's the way it goes sometimes. It's the way, that's the way it has been going for almost three weeks now with first baskets. And it is frustrating. Um, but for tonight, I told you I'm sticking with this until it doesn't make sense. It still makes sense. I'm going Joe and Thibel. Like I said, Joe made the second shot last night. It's unfortunate. First team field goal. If you can, And that's the thing. If you can get that bet, that's nice too. You just don't get as good odds. But Because a lot of these guys, it, it'll be a situation like that where they get the second basket with the first team field goal. So Joe and Thibel is still rocking with it. Going back with my boy Narkic, I he has really become like my favorite one to bet. I, I don't know if it's just because I love his name so much, but... I don't know, Nurkic. I love, I love it. It's like, that's what someone would say like in a rap song about like killing somebody. Like when they say they marked them, they got Nurkic. <laughs> so, I don't know. I love it though. I love it. Uh, but I'm, I'm going with Nurkic. And I'm going with Luka. Luka's been hot. Luka's been hitting first baskets recently. Uh, maybe it's because Porzingis is out, but Luka had been a little bit hot. Not out, but out of town. Um, Luka had been a little bit hot earlier in the season, and it looks like he's right back in it. So, I'm riding with Luca. He's just hot, period. Bet his props. Bet his props. Take Luca over 20 points, over seven and a half, over seven and a half. He hits that number almost every night. I'm telling you, that's a nice, nice bet. But Joe and Thibel, Nurkic and Luca, those are the first basket picks for today. And what's going to get it going? Playing the hits today, baby. We got house whiskey. We got house whiskey. You know, I wasn't, I'm not going to lie to you. I wasn't going to play the hits today. And we're going with Bush. Classic, classic, classic. We were not going to go with Bush because I thought I had another weekend warrior in the house and I don't. And I just didn't get it done yesterday. That's, that's on me. But I was thinking about it. And this is, we're in the pregame stage right now for the Super Bowl. This is the pregame. This is when you're in the parking lot getting ready to go into the game. And you know what? We probably won't be crushing weekend warriors out in the lot. We would be crushing Bush. So I think that this is only fitting. <clears throat> so the Super Bowl, I think what we're going to do, it's going to be three locks from everybody like normal, all Super Bowl picks. Um, if anybody has any picks that they really like on top of that, we're going to throw some of that stuff out there. We're going to have some guest pickers. We should have some guest videos. Uh, it's going to be a grand old time. I cannot wait. I'm getting very excited. All right. Let's hard and fast, right? Wow. Beautiful thing. Beautiful thing. All right, guys, do all the things. Follow the social medias, Instagram, TikTok, Twitter. Like, share, comment, and subscribe to this channel. Interact with us online. Let us know who you like, who you hate, who you tell, who you fade. You know the things we always say. Check out the merch store. we got a ton of great stuff up there. We will be back tomorrow, obviously. It's the Super Bowl. This is maybe, like, this is probably the biggest video that we do of the year. The March Madness stuff is big, too, but this is probably the biggest video that we do of the year, so I'm very excited. Um, looking forward to it. Hopefully we're talking about how much we stacked today so that we could go twice as hard tomorrow. I love you guys. Let's cash some bets. <laughs>
Let's get it fucking moving.